This doesn't suck. <laughs> yeah. This movie's awesome. There's fire. I know there's fire, dumbass. Now let's let this nerd talk about the movie or something. Beavis and Butthead do the universe exists. Nobody's talking about this movie. It's on Paramount+. Plus. Why? Why aren't people aware that this is out? It's so awesome. Yeah, that's pretty much my whole review of it. Beavis and Butthead do the universe is fantastic. It's an awesome movie. Mike Judge, I mean... <laughs> So Beavis and Butthead blast off on a NASA space mission in 1998, and they get sucked into a black hole while on their mission, and they time travel to the year 2022. And as the NSA and US government try to track them down, the clueless teens adjust to modern life, and it's pretty darn perfect. They're interacting with smartphones and what have you, and it's just, it's absolutely brilliant. On surface level, this movie may sound kind of boring, just based off of concept, yeah. Two children from the 90s interacting with modern technology. whoop de doo right? Actually, with characters like Beavis and Butthead, genius creations from the one and only Mike Judge, like, this couldn't have been any better. I love how this movie was basically just an 86-minute joke with a big old punchline at the end. And admittedly, I didn't exactly grow up with Beavis and Butthead. I wasn't necessarily allowed to watch it. I didn't even watch this as much as something like South Park, for example, which I snuck watched a lot. My dad, on the other hand, while he was in college, loved Beavis and Butthead. He thought it was so funny, and he was the one who introduced me to these cartoons a long time ago. And you know what, Dad? I am very, very grateful for that because I think these are absolutely hysterical characters. These two just talking about stupid stuff like farts and how much movies suck and what have you. These are just really fun characters and Do the Universe honestly just takes these characters on a journey that you don't really expect. One of these kids, Beavis, actually goes through a gigantic journey where he feels like he's falling in love with someone and how he doesn't really think Butthead just doesn't understand him and Butthead, on the other hand, just thinks that Beavis is being a dumbass, as usual. It's honestly pretty genius what they do. And the whole setup to this joke is absolutely brilliant. Beavis and Butthead are sent to space camp as punishment for just f***ing up a science fair. And they're performing a task at the space camp involving this simulator rocket that very much looks like intercourse. And they master it. <laughs> they master it. So you would expect when this attractive older woman comes around and asks them to go on this mission with her, they kind of get everything misconstrued. Now this plot line is very, very similar to Beavis and Butthead Do America, where it pretty much just feels like the same joke. But just the setup and the payoff and everything involving Do the Universe, I think this is better than Do America. It is honestly absolutely genius what they do here. And I don't want to get too deep into spoilers here, because... If you're big gigantic fans of Mike Judge, if you love Beavis and Butthead, if you love Office Space, this is going to be the movie for you. So I definitely recommend checking this out. It's on Paramount+. Plus. The jokes in here are too many to count. There's a whole sequence involving a smartphone where they just think it's like a TV and they're taking a picture of this family. And uh, I don't want to get too into detail about what they do with this smartphone, but uh, <laughs> when they figure out the capabilities that it has... It's awesome. The payoff and the montage that comes with it is stuff of comedic legend. Now, yes, one of the big challenges of Do the Universe is how Mike Judge was going to approach some of this comedic material that was more acceptable back in the 90s. That isn't so much these days. Well, I hate keep using this word here. I hate sounding like a broken record in these videos, but it's handled brilliantly. There's a whole sequence where Beavis and Butthead go off to college, which you can imagine they are not fans of because they think school sucks. Because of course they do. And they wind up in a gender studies class. And the whole, again, the whole payoff to this joke that they're at college, it's genius. It's absolutely genius. I can't believe I'm saying this. I cannot recommend Beavis and Butthead due to universe enough. It is on Paramount Plus, available for you guys to stream right now. I'm going to give Beavis and Butthead Do the Universe an A. Absolutely hilarious. I really hope this is not the last Beavis and Butthead style movie that we get. Hopefully it's not a 25 year gap in between this time. But let me know what you guys thought of Do the Universe down in the comments section below. Did this make you want to go and see it? Did this fly under your radar? If you watched Beavis and Butthead, what is your favorite episode? As always guys, I love making these videos. 
I love discussing all brand new things, movies and entertainment with you guys on the regular. But if you're a new viewer, do consider smashing that subscribe button and hit that notification bell right next to it so you don't miss a second of the action over here. And feel free to hit that thumbs up on your way out. This would all be tremendously helpful, guys. And hey, stay tuned for more exciting content hitting this channel very, very soon. Something did come up tomorrow night on Thursday at the time of recording, so I unfortunately won't be able to catch Thor Love and Thunder like I was telling you guys, but... I will be seeing it on Saturday morning. Hopefully I should have a review out for that by Sunday the 10th, so please bear with me, please be patient. In the meantime, I will start my Lord of the Rings series. I've got Fellowship of the Ring on the docket, so keep your eyes peeled out for that review. Along with much, much more, my friends. Y'all are the best. Thank you all so, so very much again for supporting this channel. With all that being said, back talk, commence!